A veteran service dog was stolen along with his car. Tonight, KCAL 9's Rachel Kim is live in Downey where that crime happened. Rachel. Susie Apollonio Munoz says he doesn't go anywhere without his service dog, Marcy. Well, that was the case Saturday night. Marcy was in the front seat of his car right here when someone took off with her and his Honda Civic. It was a late night snack run at this Arco gas station in Downey. Around 10.30 p.m. Saturday, Apollonio Munoz made a quick stop to grab a soda and chips. But when he came out, his car and dog were gone. It was a uh, shock and then panic um, because my first reaction is, where's Marcy? I just completely lost it. Munoz has been at a loss without Marcy, a 10 year old pit bull mix he adopted from a shelter almost two years ago. She's been going through training to be the Army veteran service dog. Munoz suffers from combat related PTSD after serving in the Iraq War. She helps me throughout the day with different things. So if I'm having a bad day, she's there to comfort me, to make sure that I'm taken care of, and to keep other people away so that way she, I'm able to take care of myself. This 34-year-old vet is worried about Marcy because she has allergies and is on a special diet. She also has separation anxiety. Emotions took over when I asked Munoz what it would mean to him to feel Marcy at his side again. It would mean a lot. <laughs> Sorry. Like, I don't see, I don't care about the car at this point. I just want her. Marcy is chipped. Problem is, Munoz's cell phone was also in the car when it was stolen, so if someone were to find her, he wouldn't be able to get the call. Munoz hasn't been able to get out of bed since Marcy was taken. He has this message. If someone's willing just to turn her in, no questions asked at this point. I just want this nightmare to end. I just want Marcy to come home. Investigators will be checking to see if this security camera caught anything. If you have any information or see Marcy, please call Downey Police.